Hello, Cancer, my darlings, and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So, Cancer, I'm here doing your daily reading, and there are two men. Um, these are two men who may know each other, but they don't really like each other. Um, but they can't take their eyes off of you, okay? <laughs> you walk into a room, Cancer, and these people are like drooling. I don't know what it is that you're... Uh, you've gone through a transformation, okay? You've transformed. You could have um, grown out your hair. You could have... I, I don't know, been working on your body, you're looking really good, but it's your energy, you know, and I just feel like you're, you're out and about or you walk into a room or something and these people are there and they're absolutely captivated by you, okay? I feel like these are two exes that have been really controlling with you in the past, okay? Maybe they tried to control an outcome for you, maybe they um, broke your heart and were hoping that you would chase after them but instead of chasing them you worked on yourself and now you're like showing yourself to the world it's almost like spirit is rolling out the red carpet like ta-da there's cancer behold the lovely one right these both of these people are finding you absolutely gorgeous um you could have been like at an event or um, this could have been just you walking around outdoors, you know, um, you could have been going out uh, grocery shopping, garage sailing, um, you could have been at a park, you could have done whatever, okay, out and about around other people and these two see you from a distance. Um, I don't think they approached you. I honestly, I don't even think you realized that they were around. You, I feel like you don't know that they were watching you, that they saw you, and they were both like in awe. It says here, inspiration, awe, dreams, okay? Um, these two could be dreaming about you. They, I feel like they're, they're exes, and they're like, oh my gosh, I want cancer back, okay? I feel like they think you're absolutely beautiful, stunningly beautiful, beauty, and there's something about your energy. It's like you're out here turning heads, Cancer. But here's the thing. These people kind of stay in the background. Like they're too... Um, one of them may even be acting like they don't care. Like they'll turn their nose up at you or something like that. And the other one is just like... they. they both of these people find you gorgeous, beautiful. Okay, it's it's that energy, it's that glow about you though, Cancer. I feel like you're a natural beauty. And when you go out, when you step out, you like to look presentable. You like nice things. You you like to wear pretty clothes, you know. Even if you're out there walking around, usually I'm like in a sweatshirt and a pair of jeans, something like that, right? Even if it's like that, Cancer, these people, they saw you. You don't realize that they were they were watching you, right? Um, you had no idea that they were around watching you, but they saw you and they couldn't take their eyes off of you. I'm hearing that song, you're just too good to be true. Can't take my eyes off of you, <laughs> right? You'd be like heaven to touch. I want to hold you so much, yeah. Anyway, my darlings, yes, look, star energy. You could even have some kind of platform, social media, anything on the internet. Uh, you could be posting beautiful photos of yourself, okay? I kind of get the sense of that they saw you out walking around. You could have really long, beautiful hair. Like you're smelling good. There's something about your perfume is like they can smell it in the wind. I don't know, Cancer. You're driving these two people insane. And I feel like they have been talking about you. Like they kind of huddle together and whisper about you, but they don't want you to know. And I feel like both of these people are afraid to approach you. Okay, like I said, they're... They're acting like they, they're not looking or they're acting like they don't care, Cancer. <laughs> and there you are, beautiful Cancer. And they're wondering, how did you go through this transformation? Or 
there uh, maybe there's something about you that they didn't notice before. Um, that's kind of the energy that I'm getting. Like how how could I have missed this? Yeah, there's something about you they didn't notice it before, and now they're like in awe, and they they feel like both of them feel like they can't get close to you, like you're unapproachable, unattainable. Okay, too good to be true, right? Anyway, my darlings, just take what resonates, leave the rest behind, and thank you, Cancer. I love you so much. Um, thank you for all of your support. And then that was a confirmation, you guys. My phone just dinged. Um, and don't forget about the giveaway, okay? I will include um, all of the details at the end of this video, so stick with me to the end, all right, Cancer? And I'll go through all of the items and tell you the easy way to enter. Yeah, these are exes. They both want to get back together with you. Four of Wands energy to me. I'm getting this real daydreamy kind of energy off of this. Um, yeah, dreams. So these people are, they instantly go into these daydreams about you, Cancer. You're such a mystery. They have no idea um, how you've gone through this transformation. I, I mean, they, they can feel that earth angel kind of energy off of you and i'm you know i'm hearing to the party don't start till i walk in yeah <laughs> so cancer when you walk in a room or they they've seen you out and about walking around okay <laughs> um and when you walk in it changes the energy you like you change the energy everywhere you go um you've got this beautiful light carefree kind of happy down to earth airy kind of energy i don't even know how to describe it you're absolutely beautiful and yeah that's these people find you absolutely amazingly beautiful they both feel like they missed out on an opportunity with you in the past both of these people could have turned their noses up at you thought they were better than you i feel like they were both very controlling Okay, um, maybe they, they wanted you to be kind of subservient to them or submissive. I don't know. But they're seeing you now walking with confidence. You've got, a, you've got this pleasant look on your face. You're absolutely gorgeous. You could have lost a lot of weight or something like that. I feel like you've been working on your body. Yeah, it's almost, it feels like spirit is like um, kind of rolling out the red carpet for you or something like that. You There's this intensity about you, and I feel like um, it's like uh, royal bloodlines, you know, light worker kind of energy. Yeah, empress energy, that's, what it, that's pretty much what it is. The empress attracts the attention of everyone. There are two people. There's two masculines here that are thinking you're too good to be true. Or how could they have, how could they have not seen how special you were before? Because you're coming out as this very special, mysterious star energy. Very strong and confident and beautiful. The star and the empress... That's gorgeous, okay? Um, how could they have not seen this before? Yes, it's all true. You're a mystery, an enigma to these people, untouchable. You kind of float or something. I don't know. I'm getting this very floaty, um, light-hearted, beautiful energy off of you. Look at you. You're stunningly gorgeous. Whoever you are, you're beautiful. You know, I mean, you walk into a room and everybody's kind of doing a double take. And you don't notice it, Cancer. I feel like you don't notice it. You know, you're just kind of moving through your day, right? I feel like you've been noticing all the beautiful things around you and not noticing who's around you watching you. Look at this earth angel energy, empress energy, high priestess strength the moon card and the star you have got to be kidding me cancer you're absolutely gorgeous whoever i'm talking to 
um, the star, the earth angel, high priestess, <laughs> empress. These are the these are the three most beautiful car, beautiful people in the deck. You embody all of this. You embody beauty and inspiration. These people are literally captivated by you. But they're, they're, they don't say anything. They like, um, they're afraid to approach you. I feel like because of how they've treated you in the past. All right. Yeah, these are people that you've given your love to in the past and you're not anymore. Queen of Cups energy, she's extremely beautiful as well. So they're, they're seeing you out and about. You're, you stun these people. Like it's, it's stunning to them. Okay. Yeah, look at them. They're like drooling over you, Cancer. And here's Spirit showing you off. That's this. Ta-da! Behold Cancer. That's what they're doing here. They're showing you off. Spirit is showing you off, man. And, and somebody here is just like melting. I don't know. You make these people feel like they're, I don't know. You make them like weak in the knees. <laughs> yeah, but they're kicking themselves now, Cancer, because you're unattainable. You're unattainable, unapproachable, okay? Untouchable. It's like they can't come near you now. This is These are people who have totally wronged you. I feel like they put you in the Ten of Swords, and now it's them feeling this way because they're seeing now what it is that they missed out on. A beautiful, inspirational earth angel star, okay? Um, you could have recently posted photos of yourself. These people are drooling over those too. Not knowing what to do. Like I said, you walk in the room, Cancer, and you make these people nervous. You make them nervous. They Seriously, they're weak in the knees here. I feel like they want to approach you, but they can't. Their path is blocked here. You're extremely abundant as well. You could, be, you could have an online business. These people could be watching you work. Oh, Cancer, holy cow. You're a knockout, Cancer. I just feel like you're, um, you have such a powerful effect on these two people. Both of these people, yeah, look at them. They're obsessed with you. Um, both or one of these people could have possibly a toxic addiction as well. They could be jealous of each other. Uh, they could be, you know, jealous of your abundance, of your beauty. I just feel like they're obsessed. They can't stop what, you're too good to be true and they can't take their eyes off of you, Cancer. Yeah, Wheel of Fortune, they're, I feel like they're adding up your money, how much money you could make. This is something they're very jealous about. So I feel like these, these two could be um, low on their finances. They could be having some struggles financially. They're very upset because um, they've walked away from you. These are two people who have turned their back on you. First, they tried to control you. Maybe they tried to play games with you. Okay, they've turned their back. They walked away from you. They could have ghosted you. Now these people see you out and about, and they're like, I mean, it knocks the wind out of them. It does. They can't believe how much you've changed. And you're, you're like, I feel like you were beautiful before, but now these people are like, um, they're, they're captivated by you. And I feel like it's not just about your looks. It's about, it's about your, your money, your confidence, your abundance, your stability, okay? And it's about your energy, right? Like, I feel like when you walk into a room, you change the energy of the whole entire room. Like, people could be turning around and staring at you, Cancer, and you don't even know. 
Like you don't know you're doing this. You don't realize that you're turning heads and driving people crazy. Um, you're just happily kind of doing you, you know, focusing on um, things that make you happy, right? This could be you just walking through a parking lot and everybody's like turning around and staring at you. It's that energy, you guys. It's the energy you give off. All right, the energy that you're in. But yeah, you're absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, you make the whole room just kind of pop. Look at you. You make the whole room just kind of pop. You change the dynamic and the energy of wherever you are, okay? The party don't start till I walk in. That's what I'm hearing. Um... You know, you may be noticing that people want to talk to you, that strangers come up and talk to you, or, you know, you're making people laugh, you're making people smile. Um, the, a lot of people are, like, watching you, Cancer. Try to take notice of this, because you don't even realize you're doing this. You don't. You don't realize how much attention you're actually getting out here. I feel like you are just turning heads, Cancer. Six of Wands energy. Yeah, look, everybody's like, now everybody starts wanting to have a piece of cancer. Yeah. Yes. Wish fulfillment. Yep, and you don't realize it's happening. Look at you. You walk into a room, right? You change the dynamic and the energy of the room. Everyone around you is like taking notice of you, okay? You don't realize that you're doing it, all right? You, you, you um, move through wh whatever building or wherever the park or whatever this is, and people are like, this is you turning heads big time, you know? All these people are going to be following you around like little lost puppies. Cancer? <laughs> They're unable to stop thinking about you. Yeah, wish fulfillment. Yeah, you walk into a room and it's like alarms go off or um, everyone is like, wow, who is that? Okay, that it's that kind of energy. Who is that? I got to get close to that. Okay, that's the feeling I'm getting. Yes, that's another confirmation. And you have no idea you're doing it, Cancer C. You're, you're, not, you're not looking around. That You're just facing forward with this beautiful energy, this beautiful smile, this beautiful scent. There's something about your perfume. Something about the perfume you're wearing. Um it it's it stays on someone's mind like you stay on people's minds and now there's and there's two exes that are picking up on this energy seeing you in your beauty holy cow and you're just being quiet keeping to yourself just moving along you know um oh my gosh there's two people that are falling on their knees please give me another chance with cancer this is somebody who's turned their back on you, realizing that they um, now they want you. You know, uh, they should have never left you behind. You make these people weak. Now there's two X's here, right? That are um, that can't stop. They can't take their eyes off of you. Can't stop watching you. Um, they want you back, right? But then there's two other people. I feel like these are, these are two new people, strangers. This is just what you do to people. Look at this, all of this attention. <laughs> you walk in a room. You've got the hermit energy. Can't stop thinking about you. You're turning the head of this knight of wands, this six of cups. Okay. Um, this cancer Pisces Scorpio masculine. Look at them all. Following, following you around like little lost puppies. Give me a chance. Just a little chance. I think everybody wants a chance with you, Cancer. Holy tamole. And you are the Ten of Cups. Your wish fulfillment. Yeah, I'm hearing 38 special fantasy girl. You're my fantasy girl. Been a little later. 
Fiddle-ear-ear. Yeah. Um, so you're... <laughs> and look as you move. All of these people just are attracted to you like a magnet. That's that Empress energy. People could even be fighting for your attention. These two exes could get into like a little fight. A competition this is competition so they're gonna be competing with each other for you soon here cancer okay they're already praying for another chance they're gonna compete they're watching you stalking you keeping close track of you watching whatever you put out on social media on the internet following you right <laughs> I'm just seeing all of these men following behind you. Okay. Oh, wanting a chance. Drooling. Drooling over you, Cancer. Holy cow. Yeah. I feel like your two exes are this King of Pentacles and this King of Cups. Um, you could have been dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, heavy on Virgo. This person can't stop thinking about you. You're definitely their fantasy. <laughs> um, and then there's this King of Cups, right? Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. This person's all up in their feels, feeling sorry for themselves because they had you and they lost you. And now they both, both of these exes want you back. And as you move through your day, I am telling you, even if you just kind of like take a glance behind you, Cancer, you'll notice people just are staring. Okay, but people are still kind of trying to figure out your energy. Like, um, you walk in a room and it's like these people don't know what hit them. It's a, it's a mystery. Like, they don't know how to get close to you. They don't, um, this energy sort of takes them off guard, you know. Somebody's about to approach you and talk to you, Cancer. Look at all of these men. You've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Wait, one, two, three, four. Yeah, seven, seven men. Seven men, it looks like, watching you. <laughs> oh, Cancer. And you're just you're just doing you. You're happy doing you. I feel like you're single. I feel like you're making all of these people nervous Where, wherever you go. Um, people are, are, are stunned. There's going to be someone coming back around here with an apology. I'm kind of getting the sense it's this King of Cups. You could be dealing with a Pisces. Look at one. Look, here's the King of, the, this King of Pentacles. This one, that's one of these exes, okay? This King of Pentacles is coming towards you, wanting to talk, okay? They may send you a text message, give you some kind of phone call. And then we've got this King of Cups who's coming towards you with an apology. So both of these people want to talk to you. They're about to take some kind of action. You're about to see a whole lot of action in your love life. Because I'm telling you, even if you don't want either one of these exes back, they're going to try. And um, you also have many other options that are interested in you right now. You just don't realize it. You're gorgeous. Something about your hair and the shininess of your hair or something like that. I don't know, man. And your perfume and, ooh, cancer. What are you doing to these people? <laughs> Oh, you keep coming out, though, as the Queen of Swords energy. I keep seeing this. I feel like um, Cancer, maybe right now you're just happy doing you. Maybe right now you just, you're just enjoying your time, getting out there, having, you know, having a good time at peace, right? I feel like maybe you don't want a lot of attention on you when it comes to men. And you can feel them now. I, especially holding your sword up, you may be feeling like you are attracting a lot of attention. You may not notice it while you're out and about, but you can feel it. And maybe you don't want anyone around you right now. Maybe you're happy being single because you're happy, <laughs> you know. Um, maybe you're enjoying this time. 
So I feel like, you know, I it's got it's giving me this energy whereas I want to get out and about. I'm happy. I want to I'm going to look good. I'm going to smell good. I'm going to I'm going to have a great day. I'm going to have some fun and enjoy myself, but everybody better stay away from me. I don't want to date. I don't want to talk to anyone, right? It's kind of like that. Like people can see you and feel your energy, but you're you're unattainable right now. You've got this um You've got this, I just, uh, I, you know, I don't want to meet anyone right now kind of energy, okay? And that's one of the things that are attracting all these people to you. Like they got to have you or something. I don't know. You walk in the room and everybody starts drooling cancer. <laughs> you know? <laughs> and I feel like you're out there looking good and smelling good because it's all for you. You know, you you feel good in these clothes. You feel good when you have your favorite perfume on. You're doing your hair for you. You're just doing things that make you happy. And it's showing. It's showing, Cancer. Ooh. Everybody's got the hots for you right now. Look at this. Ace of Wands, you are, you're driving all of these men berserk. Okay? Everywhere you go. Everywhere you go. It's like they feel like they've got to have cancer. Wow. Yeah, so cancer, you are um, you are about to be approached. I feel like it's two exes that are coming in, wanting you back, feeling a lot of passion for you, okay? They are, um, they're completely captivated. I don't even know a better word for it. Um... And you've got other people that are going to want to approach you and date you as well. Okay, so you're going to have all of these people coming at you all at once, kind of. Okay. Um, and, uh, yeah, so get ready, Cancer. Your love life is about to be popping. Anyway, my darlings, I'm going to take this into Patreon. Um, I want to see what happens next, you know, especially with these two exes. That's these two people here. Um, and all of these new people wanting, wanting a chance with you, or these are strangers. Um, you may notice that people are like following you around. There was yesterday, I told my daughter too, I'm like, I've seen that same truck. And it was an unusual truck. I've seen that truck everywhere. I saw it in this town I'm in. I saw it in two towns over. It's almost like you may notice that people are following you. You could be getting followed by people in the, in stores. People could be, I noticed that too yesterday, you guys. Oh my gosh. Anyway, Cancer, yeah. Um, I want to see what happens next with all of these men. And it, it is, it's coming across as men here, a lot of them. Um, if you're interested in that extended, there's a link to follow in the description box below that'll take you straight to Patreon. Um, and Cancer, just keep doing you. Just keep doing you, my darlings. And, and know that, um, like I said, when you, when you go anywhere, it could be anywhere, you walk into a room and you're like driving people crazy. They can't take their eyes off of you. Okay? So you may want to try to notice that the next time you're walking around, all right? Anyway, my darlings, um, I love you. I hope this helps. I hope it resonates. Like and subscribe to the channel, Cancer. Join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, my beauty, take care of you and peace out. Okay, everyone. So um, these are all of the awesome prizes that I have for this thank you giveaway. Okay. Um, we've got the Nightmare Before Christmas tarot deck, a really popular deck for the giveaways. You guys, it's fun. Um, and we've got the Lightseer's tarot deck. This, this is a very popular deck in, in tarot land out here on YouTube. Um, really great for intuitive readers as well. And we've got, of course, another chance to win the cat tarot. You guys, I include this in on pretty much all the, re all of the, um, giveaways. Okay. And then we've got, um, we've got a singing bowl, 
that's um, just like mine. I think it's a little bit smaller than mine, but it comes with its own little satin pillow and a wand. All right, we've got the singing bowl. We've got the um, pendulum set, which I think is really nice. Honestly, um, these are really nice pendulums, you guys. One is um, uh, quartz crystal. It's got a really nice weight to it, and it's pretty big for a pendulum. And this one is copper. And this one opens up. You can open it up. You can put little things in it, like maybe um, some... Um, holy water you could put little pictures in it maybe you could put um, little crystal chips in it okay so this is a really awesome pendulum very it's weighted so nice and it comes with this um really cool like board okay like an answer board all right so we've got the pendulum set and then we've got this home cleansing set okay it's also called a smudge kit it comes with a feather uh, a sage stick, a chakra bracelet. Um, it comes with its own little wooden stand for this beautiful abalone shell. Look at that. It's gorgeous. Um, so that is the smudge kit or home cleansing kit, however you want to put it. All right. And as a bonus prize, you guys, and I had to, I couldn't pass this up. I just couldn't. It's way too cute and adorable. This is the bonus lucky elephant, okay? Um, it's hand carved out of amethyst, and it, it needs a good home. So who wants the bonus lucky elephant? Please, please. Um, I, I hope he goes to a, a good home. Anyway, um, to enter to win any of this awesome, uh, any of these awesome items, all you have to do is like and subscribe to the channel and type in the name of the item that you want to win in the comment section below. That's all you got to do. And then we're, I'm going to announce the lucky winners on May 11th, you guys. Okay. <laughs> so anyway, good luck. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, right? Join this awesome soul tribe. Um, enter to win one of these great prizes. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.